We decided we better come to the beach again. And I have not been feeling good. I have issues with my sinuses today. So we're gonna go into a cave apparently that has turtles in it. Oh wow, are you serious right now? Are you serious? Look how many there are. Okay, that was a big crash. That means lots of water coming our way. Better get out. Here you go, geek feed me, seek. Mm, so good. <laughs> okay, we got a crowd here. Oh, there's another mom with more chicks. Wait, what? Behind that fence. Oh. There are two moms, seven chicks, and then a rooster, and another mom back there with more chicks. I don't know how. Or maybe he doesn't have any chicks. So end of year testing is coming up and before they had to go to like a hotel, into a classroom and do the test and they would be there all day um, and now they do it online. So they were having a pre-test to make sure that the app is running correctly and everything and since we are on vacation, the kids are using their Chromebooks that they use to travel with and this testing app does only works on, or it doesn't work on a Chromebook. So Canyon's not doing his test today. When we get back to his other computer, he'll practice then. So no testing today. We just have reading left to do for schoolwork and then we're off on an adventure. I can't put him in the pasture. Of course, he didn't have that mean look like a snapper, but you can never be sure. The front legs, he has a short neck. Good job, dude. We're in Hawaii, and we literally haven't done anything today but school and work and a lot of edging. So we decided we better come to the beach again because we're in Hawaii. And as you can see, the weather really hasn't been favoring us very well today either. It's been kind of chilly and I have not been feeling good. I have issues with my sinuses today. Um, yesterday I had a piece of rice get caught in it and trying to get that out kind of wrecked it. So it's kind of caused some issues. But uh, we're here. We're back. I found a fishy. There's a fish in the sand. It's a fish out of water. Time to cross the river. River crossing. Turtle Cave is where we're headed next, and we're gonna go with uh, some friends of ours, the Dykes fam. One of our oldest YouTube friends, I should say. They're, they're not very old, it's just we've been friends with them the longest, and here's the cool part about it. Today is their 10 year anniversary of starting YouTube. How cool is that? So we're gonna go into a cave, apparently, that has turtles in it. So uh, there's no parking or access around it, and so that's why we have to hike a little bit, but I'm, uh, I guess to say I'm excited is probably an understatement because I'm so stoked. Give the turtle space, people. Give turtle space. There he is, JD. Hey. Saving the up? day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, I think we're getting close. Just a steep path down. Oh wow, are you serious right now? Oh wow. Whoa, there's a cave. Check that out. Yeah, apparently there's turtles up in there. Really? Yeah. Kind of feels like it's raining. It's like a little waterfall coming down. 
Dang, this is cool. What? I almost stepped on a turtle. Oh, really? You got to be really careful and keep your distance, right? Yeah, I didn't even see it. Oh, because it's so dark in there? Yeah. Oh, I'm so I excited. So many shells in here. There's the first one. Oh, are you serious? <clears throat> stay back, stay back. Wow. There's two more right here. Look at those. Look how big that turtle is. Oh my gosh. Goodness, there's there's two more. Look, there's two more right here. Oh, and there's another one right there, right in the path. What? Are you serious? Look how many there are. Look how big that one is. Okay, I gotta sneak between here. Oh, wow. Hey, Sarah, keep your distance. You're a little close. Do it, go under. So our turtle's coming with it. Okay, that was a big crash. That means lots of water coming our way. Better get out. Oh, here comes the water. Always cell searching. Not soul searching, cell shell searching. So I counted up all my shells that I got, and so these are all my full ones. Um, this is the backs of them. So there's all the full ones that I found. And then I also found all these broken ones, which I saw that it's easier to, like, they're all broken in the back like this. And it's actually easier to make a necklace with those ones, because you like tie it in the front and in the back. So I'm gonna make necklaces with these. That's the cool brown on it. Oh yeah. Look at that, that one right there. I love that one. That's, that's the one that I was shell. looking for. That's a turtle shell. And this one's very similar, but it kind of has like... purple in it. Yeah, and then this one has, what's it, a little shell? Mm -hmm. So like you found, tell me. Nut. Yeah, that one, right there. that one looks like a nut. I would think that was a nut. And then this one. That one's really cool. I'll pick it up anyway. And then it's that turtle. one. Cool. And this is really rad. Look at that one. That's so cool. <gasps> I have not been able to find any full ones of this. Wait, I actually have, but not that red. And this one. Whoa. It's different colors. That one's cool. This one is just a shell, but. Yeah, but it's still it, really cool. Yeah, it's broken off and then it's smoothed yeah. over. Okay, mm -hmm. do you want to see? Look at that little guy. That guy's so cool. That's a full one. That's yeah, so purple cool. Purple inside. That's so cool. Well, I have one similar to those. Not believe how cool it was to see those turtles like we've seen turtles before on the beach and they are in the wild they are doing their own thing but it was just like so many people there and this one was just like a hidden little place so beautiful that took more effort to get to and like just standing on the edge you couldn't even see them you had to go in the cave with your flashlight to actually see them so it was so cool nature is just amazing and then to see the whales and it's 
so beautiful and I am so grateful for the opportunity we have to be here right now and to have this time together and there's like going on trips and stuff is can be expensive but the memories you make are more important than anything else and a, tr a trip a vacation doesn't have to be like this elaborate expensive vacation you can do staycations and and just like detach from the world and have and make memories and and the making memories part is what matters it doesn't have to be anything grand or anything like that like you could stay home and just get rid of the outside pole get rid of the things that usually take you away from each other and just spend time together playing board games playing card games you know drawing cooking whatever it is take the time to make the memories you will not ever regret making memories with your kids i promise showing them that you love them and nurturing that love and relationship you will never ever ever regret that we love you guys and as always you are worth it bye